Good morning. Welcome to day five of Advent. This morning I've come to one of my favourite places. I've got lots of favourite places around here, but this is one of my favourites. I wonder if you can recognise it. This is Shingle Street. We come down here fairly regularly as a family, and I think it's an absolutely wonderful place. I was down here a couple of nights ago when the moon was out, walking the dog along the beach. And it was absolutely stunning. We've been down here for the sunrise, watching the sunrise, cooking sausages on the beach. I've come down this morning, because it's meant to be a bright morning. And the reason I'm here is because the name of Jesus for today is the Creator. Jesus made all the wonderful sights that we see around here. The amazing part of the country we live in is due to Jesus the baby in the manger. Now I know what you're thinking, hang on Dave, the Bible says that God created the heavens and the earth, not Jesus. Jesus wasn't around until Christmas. A couple of things to mention with regard to that. Do you remember yesterday, Jesus became a baby at Christmas. He took on human flesh, but he existed before Christmas. He always was the I Am. And do you remember way back in the beginning of the Bible when the Bible describes how God made the world? It says, in the beginning God created the heavens and the earth. Yes, of course it does. But it also says, or tells us, how God created the world. Not the technicalities, not what it looked like, but it said, and God said, let there be light. And God said, let there be land and sea and it happened. What do you use when you speak? You use words. And God created the world, the universe, through his words, or his word. And we know, don't we, the Bible describes Jesus as the word. Of course, the Father was involved, God the Father, it was his idea. Of course, the Holy Spirit was involved. Genesis describes him as brooding over the waters, making things happen. But it's God's word who created the world. If you're not convinced, let me read for you, to you from John chapter 1 again, that brilliant chapter that introduces us to Jesus. In the beginning was the word, the word was with God, the word was God. He was with God in the beginning. Through him all things were made. Without him Nothing was made that has been made. John is telling us very clearly, Jesus is the creator. A way in a manger is often dismissed as a children's carol. But the words in that, particularly in the first verse, are absolutely brilliant. Do you remember the line? The stars in the bright sky, the stars that Jesus created as part of this wonderful creation that we live in. The stars in the bright sky that Jesus had looked down on and who the stars had looked up to, to Jesus, for the whole of their existence, are now looking down on their creator laying in a manger. It's an amazing thought. Jesus the creator in a manger. As a small, tiny, helpless baby. Have a think about that today.